Praise the Lord, everyone. Thank you for tuning in with Dr. Leisha the Preacher. <laughs> it's been a minute since I did a reading, but this is a, a, a checkup, a divine checkup reading. So let me just spray my little area, get everything together, and make this a quick one. <laughs> Make this a quick one. Clean off my little work tray here. Okay. Let me light my St. Michael candle. This is just a quickie, a quickie energy check. I know my emotions have been everywhere, everywhere. And I've just been, you know, pretty much a mess, a hot mess. <laughs> I said, let me um do a reading, see what's going on. <laughs> Why am I such a hot mess, you know? Is it just me? Maybe it's something going on in the... In the collective, you know. Ooh. There we go. Alright. And we bring a little sage. Ooh, it so takes so much, you know, to get going for a reading here. God is great and greatly to be praised. I'm still alive. You know, I'm still alive hanging in here, y'all. It ain't easy. It's, it's, it's hard. It's not easy. But I am thankful for, you know, my life, health, and strength. Even though I struggle with suicidal tendencies and things. And um, just because I have suicidal tendencies and depression issues and it doesn't mean that I'm not thankful for my life <laughs> I'm still thankful that I'm alive right now even if I struggle with wanting to be alive I still am thankful that I am alive right now so with that being said as long as I'm here I'm gonna do the Lord the Lord's work <laughs> let me spray my um hands with the goddess spray just one spray is good for this reading so this is a just a quick um energy check my sage is burning so aggressively mm. praise god praise god praise god i need him to regulate my mind every day every day some of us is just that tight. It's just that tight. We need our mind regulated. Distractions. Distractions. Mm -hmm. Obviously, I have distractions, and it's not just me. <laughs> Good thing I decided to do a reading, because I'm like, maybe it's not just me. Let me check. Do an energy check out there. Distract. Control your thoughts. Yes, I just said, Lord, regulate my mind. Regulate my mind. Control my thoughts, Lord. Lord Jesus, control my thoughts and actions to help you stay focused. Yes. Oh, stay focused, stay focused. All right. We got to control these distractions in our lives. You know? Ooh, this is right on time. <laughs> That's what I'm experiencing, distractions. Because I show sure pray for a regulated mind. Oh, the dryer turned off. Okay, good. <laughs> whoops, 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 whoops. A lot of cards came out, but the chariot. I have a lot of distractions, but it is definitely time to move. 
it's definitely time to move. I know I feel that energy of needing to move, you know. And I have moved recently. I, um, I'm no longer in my uh, apartment that I was in. I'm not in that apartment anymore. I've let it go. Um, do I have somewhere else to go? No. <laughs> I'm like, Lord, how I look checking out of an apartment and I ain't got nowhere else to go. It's called Obey God. He said move. It's time to move. Thank you, Lord, for confirmation. Thank you, Lord. Further confirmation. Bottom of the deck. The world card. Oh, my God. I need to control my thoughts and the distractions. Because the distractions is feeling rejected, feeling alone, feeling homeless. All those feelings, you know, are distractions. They're distractions. And I'm on the move. I'm on the move for the Lord. And he, you know, has the whole world in his hands. Especially my world. He has my world in his hands. Top of the deck. The Hierophant. I pulled this card not long ago, but it's in reverse today. In reverse. We just tore, I have Taurus energy on here. Taurus energy. The world card and Taurus energy. Yeah, I definitely got to control my distractions. Because I am on the move for the Lord. And I know, you know, the world is His. And He got me in His hands. I know He do. I know He do. And, um. Yeah, yeah, this is not a time, not a good time for committed relationships. Committed relationships is not working. You know, there's something else going on in my world. You know, in, in our world. I always say me, me, me. <laughs> I'm one of those readers. <laughs> I make it personal like it's me. But yeah, you know, this is not the time to be in a committed relationship for those of us who are on the move if we're on the move we don't need to be in committed relationships our world is changing God is changing our world he's moving us into uh, other situations so we don't need to commit right now alright um, angel message bottom of the deck angel message like I said this is a quickie Archangel Garby, uh, Gabriel. Gabriel, hey, hey. <laughs> All right. Guys, your creativity. Yes. Yeah, this is time for us to be creative in our new world. You know, we're moving into a whole new world. You know, we're moving into a whole new world. And this is not a time to be, you know, overly committed in relationships when God have you on the move. And, um, let's see, anything else? Um, well, let's do a healing message because, you know, when we're on the move, we need to stay grounded, stay grounded, especially if you, you know, are not committed to anyone, you know. If you're not in any, any serious commitments, you know, you still need a sense of grounding. So I'm going to do, um, nature's wisdom oracle, nature's wisdom oracle here. Praise God. Ooh, here's a couple of cards that wanted to come out. Ladybug. Ladybug Fortune. Okay. Yeah, because the world came out. Good fortune. Good fortunes ahead. It's your world. 
Jack in the pulpit. <laughs> Jack in the pulpit. <laughs> it says conditionality. You know. I like how it's both, you know, green leaves here. Green leaves. Jack in the pulpit. Uh, <laughs> this is an interesting card, especially with the Hierophant, Hierophant card coming out. You know. Maybe it's time to commit more so to the Lord than in relationships. Focus on the Lord. Focus on the Lord. And not so much uh, committed relationships on this earth. You know, focus more on the Lord. Because your, your future depends on it. Your future and good fortune depends on focusing on the Lord and not committed relationships right now while you're on the move. While you're on the move. Mm -hmm. You know, this is your time to be creative. Divines. Divine masculines and feminines. You know, don't be distracted. Don't be distracted by everything else. You know, amen to that. And then let's go with um, Angel Message, top of the deck. Oh, and Archangel Michael too. Okay, Gabriel and Michael. So you, this is a protected time, a protected time to be creative and to create the world you want. You know, for those of us who are single, single. Those of us who are not. In committed relationships right now. You know. Amen. Um, let me just read Ecclesiastes real quick. Let's see here. Where is Ecclesiastes? Because I love Ecclesiastes chapter 3. One of my favorites. I don't know what made me think of Ecclesiastes just that quick. Um, and I can't even seem to get to it, but it should be right around. And, um, I think I'm passing it. Yeah. Oh, there we go. There we go. Okay, there we go. Okay, Ecclesiastes 3. To everything there is a season and a time to every purpose under the heaven. Remember, there's a time. There's a season and purpose. Time, season, purpose. I mean, to be born and to die. A time to plant. A time to pluck up that which is planted. A time to kill. And a time to heal. A time to heal. A time to kill. And a time to heal. And this is our healing time. Our healing time. Yes, time for healing. Jesus, thank you, Lord. Time to heal. So let's heal, y'all. Let's heal. Let's heal. Allow ourselves to heal. Yes, heal. Praise God. All right, well, I think that's it, guys. Um, yeah, we have the protection of angels around us. And we are free to move about as God commands us. He orders our steps, you know. And we have nothing to fear. I've been living under a lot of fear lately. And it's time to heal. It's time to heal. Archangel Michael got my back. It's time for me to keep being creative like I'm doing with my YouTube channel, you know. I'm being creative. Um, you know, I'm managing my depression. I'm dealing with it. I'm dealing with it. You know, it may be a inconvenience to other people, but I'm still alive. I'm still alive. Thank God. Thank God. And thank God for, you know, our healing qualities, you know, ladybugs and, you know, for all life form, all life, you know, all life form helps us to heal and be whole 
and feel connected and a sense of belonging, you know. All right, God is so good. Love you guys. Bye. Oh, click like, click subscribe. Uh, if you need a reading, a personal reading, the only way to get a personal reading with me is to email me, Dr. Leisha the Preacher at gmail.com. That's the only way. Send a love offering to my cash app, dollar sign, Dr. Leisha the Preacher. All right, guys, share the word. Um, again, for those of us who are single and on the move, you know, stay that way, you know, and heal, you know, heal. Let God continue to work with us until he sends us, you know, uh, the partner that we are to be with, you know. All right, guys, love you. Bye. <laughs>